Travel Across America with me. This is Stop 7 on our 10-stop walking tour of downtown Fort Worth. We're going to talk about Hell's Half Acre and Butch Cassidy's group of bandits. One of Fort Worth's most famous legends is that of the notorious Hell's Half Acre. Famous visitors to this area were Bat Masterson, Wyatt Earp, Doc Holliday, Sam Bass, Mary Porter, Butch Cassidy, and the Sundance Kid, as well as the Wild Bunch. Controversial in its heyday and historical now, Hell's Half Acre is currently home to many of downtown Fort Worth's attractions. And we are visiting many of those in this 10-stop walking tour, including Fort Worth Water Garden, the Flatiron Building, and Hyde Park with the Panther City Fountain. Stop 6. The Flatiron Building was built in 1907, adjacent to Hyde Park. And Hyde Park is Fort Worth's original park. Fort Worth, where the West begins. Butch Cassidy's bandit gang operated in Wyoming, Montana, Idaho, Colorado, Utah, and Nevada for five years between 1896 and 1901. Their agenda included robbing banks, trains, and stagecoaches throughout the area. The Wild Bunch was part of the larger Hole in the Wall Gang, which took its name from the Hole in the Wall Pass in Johnson County, Wyoming, which several outlaw gangs used as their hideouts. They performed the longest string of successful train and bank robberies in American history. Have you subscribed yet? Oh, and by the way, you can rent a bicycle if you don't want to walk. And these bikes are free on the first Friday of every month. Check your calendar. Fort Worth bike sharing. But again, don't forget to subscribe. The Fort Worth Five, one of the most Famous photographs in Western history was taken on November 21st in 1900 at John Swartz's gallery upstairs on 705 and a half Main in Fort Worth, Texas. A Pinkerton agent later called it the bad luck picture since the gang's downfall began through their impulsive decision to dress up to the nines and have their portrait taken in a professional studio in Texas. Ways away from their last coup, a displayed copy of this unarmed shooting eventually broke the wild bunch manhunt open. These famous outlaws are positioned at 1006 Houston Street, just to the south of the Flatiron Building, and across from the convention center. They had traveled to Fort Worth to unwind in its Hell's Half Acre district. As I mentioned earlier, photographer John Swartz snapped the five outlaws in a studio portrait, and he liked it so much that he displayed a copy in his lobby. This photo became the photo on the wanted posters. This life-sized bronze replica of the Fort Worth Five photograph was commissioned by Fort Worth neurosurgeon George Cravens. It is sheltered from the weather, which keeps it in top-notch condition. Butch Cassidy sits on the far right. I'm standing next to Butch. And the Sundance Kid is on the far left. The Wild Bunch consists of Harry Longabaugh, Sundance Kid, William Carver, his nickname was News, Ben Kilpatrick, Tall Texan, and Harvey Alexander Logan, Kid Curry, and Robert Leroy Parker, Butch Cassidy. Next up, is stop eight at the St. Patrick Cathedral. Wait till you see this complex. All right, only a couple more to go. Tennis shoes on the ground. Unclassic road trip. Thank you.